my lovelies and welcome back to my channel so today we are continuing my birthday haul in this haul i am going to have shoes and a purse to share with you guys so all accessories so if you guys are interested then just keep on watching but before we begin let me remind you that subscribing is 100 percent free so please click that subscribe button and while you're at it go ahead and click that notification bell so that you're notified every time that i post i post every single week so trust me you don't want to miss out i think i'm going to start with my favorite item <laughs> The item that I was most excited about. It is actually this British brand called Holland Cooper. It's upside down. Excuse me. Oh my goodness. I love their clothes and just, just everything. That brand is how I want to dress all the time. I saw these boots that I actually saw another YouTuber wear. And I was like, oh my gosh, those look so good. And I just happened to mention it to my husband. And the next thing you know, they are at my doorstep <laughs> they are wellies or rain boots um and it has the holland cooper emblem right there and of course some buckle details and i originally wanted it in the um i think it's called gunmetal um but my husband liked the gold so he got the gold and i like the gold now <laughs> so um it is a little bit more flashy um but i don't mind that <laughs> um these are again rain boots okay i know rain boots but i had a pair of rain boots and they are from let's see they are over 13 years old now so it was time for some new rain boots and these i mean like i really leveled up with these because first of all they look so nice and sleek and i always wanted just a black pair of rain boots but the pair that i have uh, originally were um gray plaid and they are like mid-calf so it's not flattering at all and um I mean, i'm still gonna keep them for maybe like if i ever do gardening ever i can hear my husband laugh like just at the me saying that because i i don't I garden but anyways <laughs> um but these have like a sh i think this is sherpa inside the sherpa actually goes all the way down as you can see and apparently a lot of women don't even wear socks which um i don't know if I'll, I'll do that but they do i did try it on without a pair of socks and they are so comfortable so soft so just they feel like slippers <laughs> um if you have thick calves i will say um these may not work for you because i i don't even have thick calves but they're like a perfect fit for me and i mean you can like buckle these to make it a little looser but it doesn't help all that much because it just like it's just like right here and this goes like all the way up to my knee um but then again i am pretty short i'm only 5'2 so you know if, if you do have thick calves they do have other boots there available i think they have like a shorter version so i would try those out but I just love this rain boot. I never thought I would love a rain boot. Like, that is the most random... I don't know. But anyways, um, it has this, these little, like, gold button things here and here. And they have, like, a little thing so you can, I guess, hang up your rain boots. And then it says Holland Cooper all along the edge. Oh my gosh. This is so nice. I'm obsessed. I'm obsessed with these rain boots. So, um, I've been telling my husband, I'm like, we need to go somewhere cold. Just so I can just so I can wear my boots. Did also get another pair of shoes that I am actually uh, it was the incorrect size, so I'm getting the correct size. But they are gorgeous. You may see them in some pictures. I'll put a picture up there, but um, I may go into detail with those a little bit more later. But we'll see. Anyways, um, the next two items are from Guess, and we'll go with the shoes first since we're already talking about shoes. I don't even know what they call these it just says yeah it just says black on the box but i got some of these little sneakers i guess no construction literally all week and i decided to film anyways back to the shoes so i did get these sneakers i guess is what you would call them um i do have a white pair just like these that i got 
so many years ago and I had mentioned in a previous video, I think the last video, that we are planning on going to Europe later this year so um, I wanted some comfortable but stylish walking shoes and so I was planning on bringing my white pair but then I was like a lot of my bottoms are black so I wanted something black and so I got them and these are so pretty these are even prettier than my white ones I think I don't know um, the details are a lot prettier but I still feel like I like the white ones better I don't I haven't decided yet <laughs> but it says guess on the side and in the front right here you can see it's just focusing on my face right there and then it says guess on the tongue of the shoe on the back they really want to make sure you know where this has been made so so it's guess and then I love these like little rings on the on the side of the shoe they have like little diamonds it's so pretty so many pretty details and I would have liked it to be more of like a champagne gold that is like my favorite type of metal champagne gold because I wear silver and gold um, jewelry so um, but other than that I love these. these aren't the most comfortable like there's no memory foam cushion or nothing like in there so I would suggest you get your own and insert and just put it in there if you want extra comfort but they are flat <laughs> so as far as walking goes as long as it's a flat shoe I feel like I'll be okay um, but I, I think I may have to add like an insert or something like that and these are true to size um, when it comes to sneakers I would prefer to size up maybe like half a size because I try to consider like the thickness of my socks and all that um, but unfortunately she did not have half a size up so I had to stick with this but that is okay because they are gorgeous and I just have one more item and oh they included a guest magazine for my reading pleasure i love magazines like this be really nice on my coffee table um, i originally got a white bag from guest so many years ago i don't even know like seven six or seven years ago and it is this guy right here but the thing with white bags is the transfer like it's like really blue i don't know if it's showing up as bad on camera as it is in real life but um this was like a really nice crossbody bag and i still plan on using this i don't know i just can't bring myself to like throw this away or anything like that because i really do like this bag um and i used it on so many occasions but i don't know if this was like originally yellow you know <laughs> and i'm not a smoker i don't know why it turned yellow i don't i don't know how that happened it was time for me to replace her uh, I was not happy about it, but my husband was like, this looks, it's not even white anymore. Like I wore it to match uh, my birthday outfit and um, the, the white of my shirt, it, it did not match this at all. So that's when I knew it was time. <sighs> it is time. It is time. So we were at the mall and I saw the guest store and I was like, well, I might as well check guess again because that's where I got the original from and I saw this little lady just all by herself on display um, and of course this was the last one as well like I always seem to get the last one um, and even the lady mentioned like this is the last one because she had one other one but there was like a big scratch on it and so she was like wow that was that's our last one I was like it's a sign and I absolutely love it um, I did not love the price tag. This was originally, let's see, $118. I'm not a fan of that price um, for a handbag, um, especially from like Guess. I guess I should have checked like, they have like another Guess store, like a Guess, Guess, um, G by Guess. I should have checked there to see if they had any more affordable options, but Anyways, um, I will tell you the reason why I decided to stay with this. Um, they do have a version of this available on Amazon, so if you're interested, um, I will check that out. And I'll try to include a link. The only thing different with that bag and this is, first of all, the price difference. The one on Amazon is far cheaper. I think it's like $64 the last time I saw it. Um, whereas this, again, is $118. But... The one on Amazon has all yellow gold hardware, whereas this is a very champagne gold hardware, which I love. 
as I mentioned, I want all champagne gold because whether I wear silver or whether I wear gold, it, um, it'll match, you know? And so I thought this was perfect. And that is the main reason. Um, you can wear it as a shoulder bag or you can make it into a crossbody bag like so. The only thing is this is going to be there like just like flopping over. <laughs> That's the only thing, but um, I don't mind that at all. And then as you can see, it has like a croc leather detailing and it has black piping. Really, really pretty. And then let's open her up. She has like these two like button closures. She has a zip on the inside and then she has two of these little pockets on the uh, other side. Just like that. There you go. That's a better view. So two pockets and a zip closure right here. Um, and I mean, it's nothing like super fancy, but oh, and, and they do have like little feet. So that's nice. It'll kind of protect your bag a little bit. Um, but I really do love this bag. And I can't wait to take her out. Pair her with an outfit. I don't know exactly what I would pair it with. I did try some combinations. <laughs> but um, I don't know for sure yet. But really, really cute. And I love it. Alrighty, you guys. So that was it for this birthday haul. I hope you guys enjoyed. I will link the other birthday hauls um, down below as well as up here somewhere so you can check it out. I did do a part one of my birthday haul, which I will link above here somewhere and as well as in the description box down below. So make sure to check that out. Please subscribe if you haven't already. Give this video a big thumbs up and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!